Hello everybody and welcome to the third intermediate grade. Semester first subject Super Goal 5. Listen Unit 1 Lifestyle Language in Contest Listening Pronunciation About You Conversation. This lesson prepared and will be presented by Amal Muhammad Fellata. Today we will describe pictures. Number two, put true and false. Number three, practice pronunciation. Number three, four, answer questions about conversation. Here, look at this picture, please. Do you think it's a girl's or boy's room and why? I think that it's a, a boy's room. Why? Because it looks like that his favorite sport is playing tennis okay and that is so clear and may also he likes to play football right number two how old do you think the person is and why i think that the boy is around 13 or 14 or 15 why because he has his own cell phone and he has his own laptop okay and he has his own room okay maybe number four Three, what can you say about the person's lifestyle? His lifestyle, that means he likes to play tennis, okay, and to work on the laptop and to use his cell phone. Maybe I'm listening to music because this is, looks like a recorder. Maybe. Listening. In listening, girl, dear students, we're going to listen about Musa. Who is Musa? A professional football player. He's going to talk about his career and his lifestyle. You are going to put true or false, okay, after listening. That's why, number one, we are going to read the sentence, and then we're going to judge the sentence after listening to the text. Number one, Musa comes from a poor background. Number two, he spends a lot of time with his family. Number three, Musa is proud of playing for his country. Number four, he likes to wear fashionable clothes. Number five, he gives money to help those in need. Number six, Musa doesn't like the media following him. Now please listen carefully. Football changed my life. It's given me everything I have. For a poor boy from Nigeria to the stadiums in Holland and Russia, I've come a long way. But a professional football player's life isn't easy. I often train for six to eight hours a day, and when there are major competitions, you sometimes don't see your family for days. The other players become like a second family. We spend a lot of time together. The competition is tough. There are plenty of good football players out there, and the career of a professional football player is very short. Most professionals usually stop playing before they turn 30. But there are many benefits, too. For me, the greatest thrill of all is when I play for my country. You can become a hero overnight, especially if you score a goal in a big match. Of course, I get a lot of money for playing and from advertising. I hardly ever spend any money on clothes and shoes. I get those for free from sponsors. I like to dress well but I also give quite a lot to charity. I like being famous, but you lose your privacy. You can't go anywhere without the paparazzi following you. I hate that. Okay, sentence number one, it's true. Sentence number two, it's false. Sentence number three, true. Number four, true. Number five, true. Number six, true. Listen and notice how do and you, those two, do and you, are set together as one word. Then practice. Do you have a cell phone? Where do you live? How often do you get a haircut? How much time do you spend on the internet? Okay, please practice. Here, about you. Talk about your pastime and routine. How much time do you spend in your homework? Or how long you are sitting and you're doing your homework? 
How much time do you spend on the phone? For how long you keep on talking with others on the phone? How much time do you spend on the internet? You keep on searching in the internet and surfing the net for how long? That's been. How time you? Sp- how much time do you spend uh, shopping? For how long you be in the malls in the shops? For how long? How much time do you spend exercising? Okay, exercising. How much time you spend with your family, sitting with your family, chatting with the family? Okay. How much time you spend with your friends? For how long you be with your friends, especially if you hang out? For how long you be in there outside? Here, conversation. You're gonna listen to a conversation between Majid and Omar, and after that, we are gonna answer the question. So please listen carefully and follow well. Okay. How often do you go to the gym? I work out every day, except weekends. I'm a bit of an exercise freak. Exercise turns me off. Anyway, what are you doing now? I'm checking my email. How much time do you spend on the internet? A lot. I take my smartphone with me wherever I go. My friends say that my smartphone is really my best friend. You see, I can access the internet almost anywhere. Okay. Now, number one. Does Omar exercise a lot? Does he exercise a lot? Let us see. Yes, he does. He works out every day except weekend. Question number two. Does exercising turn magic off? Does exercising turn magic off? Let us see. Yes, it does. Number three. Does magic spend a lot of time on the internet? Surfing the net, checking emails, searching in the net? Does he? Let's see. Yes, he does. Number four. Why can Mazur check his email frequently? Okay, frequently. Okay, many times, all the time. Because he has a smartphone and he can access the internet almost everywhere. Wherever he goes, he can use the internet. So today we describe pictures, put true and false, practice pronunciation, Answer questions about conversation. Our references, student book, teacher book, totweer.com and Ain Park. If you have any question, you can keep in contact with us through